Hey everyone, we wanted to give you a quick update on our almond agaricus bed that we planted here in this greenhouse several weeks ago. We want to cover three things today. One is the mycelium growth before you actually see the fruiting bodies. The second is what almond agaricus will look like when, you, when it does present itself. And then the third thing we want to go over is using reishi in the garden. If you've been following along with us, you'll remember that we planted our almond agaricus bed using a spent reishi block border. Well, with the unusually hot and humid weather we've been having in Wisconsin, we've seen some very impressive reishi growth out of those blocks. So we wanted to quick cover that today as well. So again, those three things we're going to look at is one, the mycelium growth, two, the almond agaricus growth itself, and then third, the proper environment that you need to be successful in growing reishi in your garden. Mm -hmm. 